Hey everybody, welcome back to Ground Zero's YouTube channel. a ground zero camera and I cannot wait to shoot on this thing hopefully I have all the settings so I can get a good video this time around you're probably gonna have to give me a video or two to figure out what exact settings look best with the footage we're shooting so if there's a couple parts in it that don't look as good as others I'm sorry I'm still figuring it out but tonight we are going to do Boxing and wrestling. Tuesdays are one of my favorite nights of the week because I absolutely love sparring and I love wrestling. We are going to go do that tonight, but obviously we have to get ready for class first because I am not ready at all. So let's go do that and head to boxing and wrestling. All right, so now that we are all dressed and ready and we have our hair done, we are gonna go through my bag to see what I would normally bring to a night of training where I'm doing boxing and wrestling. So, let's go. So hopefully tonight's classes will be pretty big because boxing is usually big and then tons of people have tournaments, a uh, jiu-jitsu tournament coming up and obviously wrestling helps with that. So hopefully you guys will get to see that fun atmosphere that we have there when the classes are big and everybody's just doing their thing and killing it. So yeah, let's go guys. Nobody look cute in the head.
welcome to wrestling. <laughs> no, my arms are bigger. Look at those. Look at those. Pipes. Yeah, I know I got them. I wish. Are you laughing at me? Don't think I want my car to look in. <laughs> oh no. I'm laughing and shaking the whole camera. What are you bad at? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's so terrible. You should go to Buggy the Buggy. Just Buggy the Buggy. I don't know how to Buggy the Buggy. Yeah, I don't either. Hi, Jacob. Hi, Jeremy. <laughs> what are you doing? Sit in here. Hi, guys. This is Tuck, the wrestling coach at Scene Hill and Ground Zero. You're of course. Both. So how long have you been coaching Tuck? Uh, so I've been a head coach for 10 years, been coaching for 12. That's nice. Yeah. Uh, how, how have you been enjoying the wrestling class? I've been loving it. I'm not very good yet, but we're working on it. She, she lies. She's actually picked it up pretty fast. What's your favorite wrestling move? Um, I like single legs because that's about the only thing I can hit See, sometimes. Single legs, though. So. Yeah. What, else, what, what else do you like about wrestling class? Uh, I get beat up a lot, but it makes me better, so <laughs> that's <Yeah>. nice. <laughs> Olivia, and, Olivia was at a clinic in our wrestling room recently. Yes, it was so much fun. I literally, it made me want to wrestle like in college so bad. I walked out of that room and I was like, oh my goodness, we need to get a girls wrestling team in yeah. Pennsylvania because that was so awesome. See, PIAA, she's calling on you. Sanction I'm calling it. you out. Sanction girls wrestling. Let's go. And seeing Hill needs to get girls she's wrestling, so great. that way he can be my coach. <laughs> and it'll be awesome. Uh, what did you do before you were coach? Like, what was your college career? Uh, so I, so I uh, graduated from Pitt with uh, health and physical activity, and then went on when I was coaching at Bloomsburg. I got my master's in uh, exercise science, so it related really well, learning the anatomy, uh, muscles, and um, 
you know, all that good stuff, how the body works, basically. Nice. Uh, so fit in real well with, with coaching and wrestling. That's awesome. Yeah. And how have you implemented uh, wrestling and jujitsu together? Yeah, so the biggest thing is, um, the biggest way they relate is wrestling is controlling your body and somebody else's body, and jujitsu is exactly the same thing. Yeah. So, obviously there's a couple rules and you know little intricate ways that are that make the sports completely different but at yeah. the end of the day if you can control your opponent uh and you can control yourself you you pretty much have a, a really high percentage chance of winning so that's kind of how we've put how we've put into play with this trying to teach more positional awareness rather than uh rather than i think wrestling moves. has definitely helped my jiu-jitsu game i would agree like it's crazy it how they can like combine and work together. Well, I think the biggest thing for you has been your um, your ability now with wrestling to identify when you're not um, when you're in danger in jujitsu. Yeah. So you know your ability to get out, or when you're in control. So knowing that a position is is your power position and you staying there. Yeah. So I think those two things have really um, again just kind of taken your jujitsu game to a whole other level. Thank you. You're welcome. You think you're going to get promoted to your blue belt this next promotion? Um, so I am on the docket to be promoted. Nice. This guy's going to be a blue belt soon. That's exciting. <laughs> it is exciting. It's exciting. It's a good, I mean, it's a good place. We have a, a really good coaching staff. Yeah. You know. Great, a great atmosphere great too. Great atmosphere. The, the people in here are just fantastic. It's a, it's a growth growth atmosphere you know yeah. everybody's in here just trying to get better each time and, and it's you know you guys get checked at the front door and that's the best part about this is everybody's in it not only for themselves but for each other yeah everybody's supportive yeah it's great yeah. so if you're around come to ground zero because it's super supportive and fun exactly well thank you Todd. Exactly. plus you have this cool young lady here yes and we got some other some and other this awesome guy people. if you want to join wrestling so, he's awesome yeah, we, so. have a, we have a good time work hard and uh, we keep learning, keep moving forward. Yeah, well thank you. Post wrestling interview, how are you guys feeling? Great, fantastic. Great. It's good being here for All right, well moving on. Trey, how did you do in wrestling? Good, uh, it was definitely hot today. So yeah. Extra sweating, even more so than normal. Hey, but that's hard work, right? Absolutely. Like it would be okay if I had it and the ref wasn't already hard, but it's not gonna stay like that. Well, you realize that they're going to get bad anyways. I don't care. That's not supposed to look like that. <laughs> oh my god. That's not supposed to look like that. Chris, let me see your ear. <laughs> that's, that's horrible. It's not that. It's like, it doesn't even hurt. No, it looks stupid. Look, this is nothing is here. She's going to put that It's beautiful. <laughs> That's, I can't even go out in public. <laughs> no, my, my Swelling up as window. we speak. Yeah, modeling's out the window. Yeah, modeling's out the window. Can I flick it? What? <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, that is the video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you can be notified every time we post a new video. Don't forget to follow us on our socials. Our Instagram and our Facebook will be up here on the screen and also linked down below. So if you want to help support us, go ahead and give us a follow and a like. I hope you liked the video and I can't wait till the next one. Until then, have a great day guys. Bye!